Today we're gonna go over the two new Cabrina wings, the new Mantis, the new Vision and the differences. Let's do it. It's so good to see you guys. We got a special one today. The release of the newest, latest and greatest from the biggest launch ever from Cabrina Kites. But these two awesome new wings, we're gonna break them down. We have the brand new Mantis and we got a brand new Vision. Yeah, I think what's really interesting is we've both been riding the Mantis for a while. For, yep. you know, the, the Mantis has been around for three years. So that's the third version. We've been riding the Mantis for a while. And in the US, if you go to any spot, um, you see Mantis, the Mantis wing everywhere. It's a very popular wing. And so now there's a new version of it, but also a totally brand new wing that was, didn't exist in the lineup before, the Vision. So let's go over the differences. Obviously, if you know the Mantis, it's a, it's a, it's a wing that's a bit more like flat and has it is very powerful i would describe it as like kind of like a grunty uh wing and and sometimes it can be uh, a bit more like technical to fly just because um it, it it's so powerful and you, you you know you it's it's not the most like forgiving wing um but to me i just love it it just feels really good to do anything you can you, you can race you can uh, cruise, you can free, do freestyle, you can ride waves. It's just a wing that is really great at doing it all. And obviously we've been loving it for forever. Yeah. But now there is a new wing coming up in the line, which is the Vision. So you've been riding it and now actually you are thinking of switching <laughs> to the Vision. So wh how, how is the Vision different than the Mantis? <clears throat> well, first off, I, I don't know if you can see here, but there's a little more dehedral to it. So my, my biggest, the, the biggest standouts to me, the difference between the new Mantis and the Vision would be uh, the Vision feels really light, light in your hands, like very balanced, uh, almost like too easy. <laughs> like it feels really easy. The Mantis, you got to be like, it's powerful. It's got great power up and go. The Vision's just so easy. And like when you go into tacks or jibes, it's just... It just sits there. It's like, it's almost it like, like you don't have to try. Super like stable. <laughs> uh, yeah, super like stable. And then if you, are, if you come from like a kiting background, you know, what I would almost say is like, you know, the Mantis is kind of like that, like heavy bar pressure. Yep. And then the Vision is more that light bar pressure. Like you said, it just feels very light in your hand. It almost feels like you could just like always use it with the tip of your fingers. It just, it's easy to maneuver. It, it just sits there. Um, and the Mantis, you know, there's so, so many good things there too, because it's like, if you were to just straight line rocket ship run, the Mantis, I feel like you just, you can just pull in so many gears and yeah. just go. What I like about the Mantis is really that like direct feel, just because the Mantis has a bit like flatter profile and, and, and super stiff, so you have that like direct. Feels crisp. Yeah, like, exactly. It, it feels like crisp, and then the, the vision just feels like like light and, 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 and smooth. Um, so personally, I actually love both, and I think I'm gonna do a quiver, uh, a mix of both wings, but you know, we've, we've had Harry trying it after he tried the new vision, he was like, I'm switch because he's switching because he's been on it all. He's been on the Mantis for a while. <laughs> he's switching to the Vision. Now, something that you don't like. Let's not you know talk in a way that like you know. Okay, the Mantis is kind of like the the high performance wing. The Vision is like the beginner wing. This is not at all the case. Both wings can be you know perfect for from learning to high level for riding. Sure. No so question. Yeah. It's it, they are just different wings, but both. Both of them are like really good at any level. And, and I'll say one thing here that's like, it's a little controversial, I would say in some way, but it's like, so the Mantis has this really good power, get up and go. So in theory, you would think like, Mantis for sure for light winds, because a little more dihedral, you lose a little bit of the power. There's maybe not as much pull saying all this. I tested a prototype now, it wasn't the final version, but it was very, very close of an eight meter. 
By the way, uh, Vision will go from sizes two all the way up to eight. Mantis goes from two all the way up to seven. But I tried this eight and kind of we were like, wow, we're gonna try an eight. Like we never ride an eight. We only kind of go up to sixes. I loved this eight and it's straight up. Like I loved it to where I was like, I don't need to try the seven because the eight, what was cool about the Vision being a little more dihedral, like you, the big wings, you're always worried about wing tips hitting. And with that little bit of dihedral, it actually like, I felt it was so awesome because you, you don't have to do the like more advanced pumping technique. You can just like pull in and go, pull in and go. like whoop and go. And I was like, man, this wing for, I mean, even for myself, like, I mean, I like a little smaller to be a little more agile, but it was like, it was so awesome to jump. You would just like hover. Yeah. <laughs> it was awesome. Anyhow, so to say like, is one better or not for light winds? I think like Gwen said, I really truly think like it's a preference of feel and, um, Man, you, there, there's, there's more changes we're going to go into, but I just wanted to say that. That was important. Well, one thing that both of the wings have that is new on the Cabrina wings are the new handles. And the new handles are, in my opinion, like, you Huge. know, amazing, like game changer. When you pick up a wing, you know, your first connection to the wing are the handles. And yeah. so that's kind of like the, when you're going to pick up any of these two wings, this is what you're gonna you're gonna notice right away is how good the handles feel. They just make you you know like such like a direct feel. It's a nice like EVA like it just like you know feels good on your hand. You have good grip. You have good control. Uh, good feel uh, of the, the the wing. So to me, the the new handles um, game changer like m massive improvement over over the previous yeah yeah i 100 percent agree i think uh the difference in the handles just from years past it's a huge huge change and and there's a couple added features there's there's spacers that you can add in the handle so you can have a uh, really tight close to the bladder or you can you can change the angle of the handle so you can have it maybe a little bit off the bladder in the front or the back depending on however you want to use it so there's spacers and another big change is on the on the center strut, there's a bigger dump valve so that yeah. when you deflate these wings, they'll instantly deflate, which I think is a good thing. Um, but I, I agree with Gwen. I think the handles are such a huge difference because your both wings feel no matter what, 10 times more solid. Like it's, like it's the first thing you notice, like you, you don't even have to go in the water. You, pick you can up, just pick it yeah, up and you're like, you pick it up and you're like, okay, this feels good. Then you go on the water and I would say both of them are gonna feel like like rigid like like, so, like you're one with it it's like awesome. yeah you become one with it so that that's a perfect way to to say it um that's it you know we are sold on 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 these wings um and we think that you know you guys will love it so we, you should definitely check it out you know go to the cabrina website if there is a lo uh, local demo near you or a local dealer go try to uh, test them you won't regret it that's yeah, hundred percent. Go, go try them yourself. Look, we always just try to relay information from what we feel as best as we can. And honestly, I mean, you really can't go wrong here, but you know, find out what works right for you. And, um, you know, hopefully this helps you out and just kind of understanding what's coming down the pipeline with anything we put out. Um, but, uh, we just appreciate you guys. We love the sport. We love the ability to be able to fly these things and ride boards and just, man, it's such a rad sport. We're so privileged and I think we all feel the same way. So uh, feel free to leave your comments and, and uh, you know, fire away when you get your hands on one and, and, and whatever we can better help people with and sharing that information, that's why we're doing yeah. it. Once you, once you try it, drop your comment. Let us know what you what you are, you were thinking of the wing. It will help other people that are watching as well. All right, so we always want to leave on a special note for you guys, and this one's a super important one because it's perfect timing. But Gwen's calf, he's got something around it right now, and that is we want to leave you guys with you know personal health. Take care of yourselves. Eat right. You know, uh, try to get sleep, drink water, do all these things that you know mental health give yourself time that's why we do this sport so don't i guess what i'm trying to say is make sure to take care of yourself because when you take care of yourself it goes a long ways and unfortunately you know gwen had a little injury here but i think you know it puts things into perspective it makes you think it makes you work on stretching and doing these things to get back to where you feel you're living your best life yeah and in the end 
there's so many amazing things to do and you know even though maybe i can't like quite like ride or whatever i i'm stoked i go to the beach i interact with people i chat with people i spend more time on the beach because i'm not you know i can't go in the water and 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 uh there's so many awesome things that you know you can do you can go to the beach and and, and help people chat with people um i i feel i, I you know I, I always want to do more filming but usually i'm like you know i also want to ride <laughs> now i'm like just like filming that's fine you know so many awesome things to do so when when you something happened to you like uh, you you break your wing and you're not gonna be able to repair it or whatever find something else that brings you you know joy and and don't be too hard on yourself um if if you are injured or whatever you will be back keep the stock alive go out there be the best version of yourself help people they are gonna help you be the best version of yourself like Damien is doing for me Nah, just give back I mean you know find the positive in everything just like Gwen does he had a little setback here but if anything it's making him stronger he gets to study tricks he gets to do all these things and uh, reflect and, and share share his passion with everybody so we're super grateful and uh, you guys will probably see about 400 more videos because <laughs> he's off the water. <laughs> All right, on that note, we love you guys. We will see you next week. Thank you.